So the first hairstyle is called I haven't washed my hair for days and I have a very oily scalp and I need to go to work, I need to go to a party, I just don't have time to wash my hair. So this hairstyle is perfect for all those days. I'm just going to go on and do a Ariana Grande high ponytail leaving some of my baby hairs behind and you can use a comb to sleek out any hair flies and that's it for the second part of this hairstyle you're just going to wrap your hair into a bun for the bun part you just need to hold the area where you have tied the ponytail and then start twisting the hair and burn it around this is very important step guys just use both of your hand to make a bun and when in the end you think the bun is looking fine it has that volume and it is looking sleek and perfect you can go on and use another hair tie to tie your hair and if you don't have a hair tie just use some bobby pins to secure the bun at place and next I'm just going to use the comb again to make sure there is no hair flies. If you think some hair is popping out just use a bobby pin to secure the hair into the bun itself in that way the bun is going to last longer. This hairstyle is perfect for work days, perfect for parties, perfect for wearing ethnics like saris where you have a very sexy blouse to it. So yeah, such hairstyles look so elegant with some heavy jewelries and light makeup. So yep. You can also clear out the flies using some hairspray if you have. Um, you can also use some water or wax, hair wax or some hair gels that you use on a daily basis. And that's it. So sleek hair burn is like a survival hairstyle for oily scalp and bad hair days. So yeah, I love the way it had turned out and I really use it on a daily basis for my work days. You can ask my colleague guys, they will actually tell you this. <laughs> So we all have some of those days where our scalp is feeling really oily and we really don't have time to wash our hair and we don't want to go for a sleek hairstyle because sleek hairstyle could be a really hard task. Um, it's a very tricky task basically. So this hairstyle can work for you. This is a half updo bun. So for this I'm just splitting my crown section away from rest of my hair and here I'm showing you that you want to make sure your scalp is invisible and then I'm going to tie them separately so that they won't mess up with each other. So now comes the most tricky part and most amazing part. So if you learn this technique, you're sorted for oily day poof hairstyles. So as you can see, I middle parted my hair and then I'm picking all of the hair from the side of my uh, crown section with my hand as you can see. And then I will place one of my hand in the back side of my crown like so. So as you can see I'm holding the hair tie while I'm twisting my hair and also I'm holding the crown section where I want my bun to be while I'm twisting my hair because this will make sure uh, my bun will be at that exact same place where I want it to be and it will also make sure that my poof isn't falling apart and the volume which we have given to the poof isn't falling apart. So this method is a very quick technique which you can use uh, for a voluminized poof guys. So after securing the bun with some elastic band, I will secure the bun at its place with some bobby pins. This will make sure the bun won't move and it won't loosen up. And again, I will just go through my poof side uh, with my fingers to make sure it has that wavy texture and it has that volume and the poof is intact and at its place. After that you can let go of your hair and run your fingers through your hair. You can straighten them up if you want to and that's about it. If you want uh, that your bun will look more secured and more cute, you can go on and use a piece of hair from back side of your hair and wrap it around your bun. It will also make sure the hair dye is invisible and this will actually secure the bun. Uh, you know the more poppy pins you use, the more secure your bun is. So yeah, that's it. I love the way this has turned out. I've done a similar kind of video in one of my previous videos that was a Dear Zindagi one but I like this one more because this is like a more detailed version of it. And that's it for today's video guys. I hope you enjoyed watching this. Please make sure you subscribe to my channel and like this video and share it if you want to and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.